Hey guys, I am going to do um, the Savannah Spurlock case. My best friend called me this morning and had told me about it and was asking to maybe do some research and reach out to Spirit or her to see if we can get any answers. I guess um, this happened in Lexington, Kentucky and um, is what I've heard from my girlfriend is that Law enforcement is kind of hush-hush on it, and there's not much being done. I guess uh, they were speaking about putting a reward for her, but there is no money involved in her, um, oh my cats, in trying to locate her. And I think that with a reward money, it isn't law enforcement that puts up the money. It's her family, friends, or somebody that would just donate it. But with that being said, um, I'm just gonna kind of tell you what I know about the case. And um, is what I know is she's been missing since January 4th. She had twin boys in December. Um, what else? She is a single mom. I think this makes her a total of four children. Um, she was last seen at a gas station on surveillance there, but I guess she got in an argument maybe with a friend at the bar and ended up leaving with males, two or three males that they didn't know. Um, I guess these men have been questioned but are not suspects. So I don't know, um, the case kind of shrouded in secrecy. Imagine that, another girl goes missing and it's shrouded in secrecy. So what is really going on? What, you know? I mean, it's just, it's just every other day. It seems like it's someone, right? Um, so with that being said, we all need to be mindful of our surroundings, even if we're intoxicated. Just, you know, don't just trust anyone. Just don't, you can't these days. Um, so I'm going to do an ovulus session with her and a flashlight activity with her and see if we get anything. When I did look at her pictures, she's so pretty. Um, but I got that uh, she is going through or went through postpartum. Now that's something I went through back in 2007, so I can understand that, but I do see that surrounding her. Um, I'm going to go ahead and dive into the ovulus and the flashlight and not give you too much of what I am feeling because I already know information on it, so um, that would be kind of silly. But Anyways, we're gonna do an ovulus and a flashlight and see if we get anything from her or spirit, all right? So come on, let's go. All right, guys, we're gonna reach out to Savannah Spurlock. My best friend is the one that sent me the information on her and asked me to try and reach out to her to find out answers. I guess law enforcement is not doing anything about it and um, this poor girl needs to be found or we need to find someone that has done something to her. So Savannah, I'm going to turn on my ovulus or spirit and you can speak into it and then we'll do flashlight. So Savannah or spirit, if you're listening, you can turn the flashlight on for yes and off for no, okay? Savannah. Air. Cards. Savannah or spirit, can we speak about what has happened to you or what has happened to Savannah? What happened after you left the bar? Or what happened after she left the bar? Hour. August. Front. 
who is friendly. Sidian, are you here? Sidian, my name is Rachel. And I'm just trying to get some answers for you. We're going to do the flashlight so we can do yes or no. Okay. What's done? Savannah, are you here? What was spread? They were hiding? Or you were hidden? I'm just going to say it. I think that she's passed. Somebody got some money. Who's Bill? Maybe Bill Money. Joe. Who's Joe? Is he a boyfriend? An ex boyfriend? Somebody you didn't know? She's not happy. She wants justice. Did any of your friends know this was going to happen? You can touch the flashlight to turn it on for yes.
what's always. Who is Joe? Savannah, do you have anything else you want to tell us? Your babies are beautiful. You were beautiful. What can we do to help? I'm gonna have to let you go here in a few minutes. Thank you for speaking with me at all, I appreciate it. I will continue to communicate with you. How did it go so wrong? How did it go so wrong? So fast. All right, goodbye. I'm closing the door. I'll bring it open again here soon for you, okay? Goodbye. All right, guys. There's some words for us to work with on this case, all right? Until next time.